In preparation for this week's message, I was thinking of things that exactly for some impact or something that was going to bring some more sales techniques to your life. And then it hit me on the way over here as stopping to get gas. And I realized something. And this week I want to talk about thieves. Not the kind of thieves you might think. Not bandits or shoplifters or pickpockets. The kind of thieves I like to call the happy thieves. Now, we all know these people. You wake up happy. You wake up to conquer the world. You feel great. You look great. You're ready to take on anything that comes your way. You're ready to go. Then you walk in and you see one of these people. You come to the office. You come to wherever you are. You come to the gas station. You see one of those people. And one of those people that say something like, that dress looks a little tight, doesn't it? Or they say something like, what happened to your hair? Or they say something, I heard you ruined that sale or it blew up in your face. Okay. They are trying to steal your happiness and steal your zest. They steal your confidence. And, and as you're going on, you're trying to figure out, what, what did I do to deserve that? Or how did that happen? And you came in with all this. I'm going to take on the world. You woke up ready to go. And in one sentence, someone was able to steal your smile. Never, never, never let anybody steal your smile. Never give anybody the ability to change your day or your mood. Let me say that again. Don't ever give anybody the ability to change your day or your mood. Okay? They steal from you in different ways. They'll take your zest. Don't ever give another person the ability to take what you have inside. Now, listen, of course I know that things are going to happen. There's going to be challenges in your day, and there's going to be things that are going to happen that you're going to have to overcome. In your job, there's things that are going to go through that you're going to have to figure out that aren't going to be the most things that make you smile. But just don't let those happy bandits in your life. I believe these are the people that are either jealous of your success or your happiness. And they find negative in people like there's some kind of reward for it. They're looking for the things in other people to make themselves somehow feel better. Or justify the bad things that are happening to them to make you feel like you're smiling and I'm not. You shouldn't smile. People become what they think of themselves. Good and bad. If you think of yourself as a beautiful, hard-working, successful individual, I truly believe it'll come. If you see yourself as always struggling paycheck to paycheck, just getting by, wondering when am I going to have some money, when is that sales going to come, when things are never going my way, that's what you're going to be. Now, you would never allow someone to reach in your pocket and steal money out of it. I believe something that's more important than stealing money out of your pocket would be your smile. So you wouldn't allow anybody to steal from you that. Don't allow anybody to steal your smile. So do me a favor this week. Call them out on it. Take some time, and when people are saying that stuff, or you hear them in the background, or you hear them say something to somebody else, smile to yourself and respond to them by saying, smile, bandit. Because don't let anybody steal your smile this week. Make it a great week.